Understanding Red Card Offense in English. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to dive into a very interesting English phrase Red Card Offense. This term comes from the world of sports, but it's also used in everyday English in some fascinating ways. Let's explore what it means, where it comes from, and how you can use it in your conversations. The term, red card offense, originates from the sport of soccer, also known as football in many countries. In soccer, a red card is shown by the referee to signify that a player has committed a serious violation of the rules, leading to their immediate removal from the game. It's a penalty that can have a big impact on the match. So, when we talk about a red card offense in English, we're referring to an action that is considered a serious wrongdoing or violation. In everyday English, red card offense is used metaphorically. It refers to actions or behaviors that are considered highly inappropriate, unacceptable, or seriously wrong in a particular context. For example, in a workplace, not meeting a critical deadline might be seen as a red card offense because of its seriousness. It's important to note that this phrase is often used in a somewhat humorous or exaggerated way to stress the gravity of the action. Let's look at some examples to see how red card offense can be used in different contexts. 1. Workplace. Failing to double-check the report for errors was a real red card offense, and it upset our client. 2. Social situations. At the dinner party, talking about politics loudly was considered a red card offense. 3. School. In our school, cheating on an exam is a red card offense and leads to immediate suspension. These examples show how the phrase can be adapted to various situations to indicate a serious mistake or violation. I hope this video helps you understand the phrase, red card offense, and how it's used in English. It's a great example of how language can borrow from different fields, like sports, to express ideas in a vivid and relatable way. Keep practicing! And don't forget to use this phrase when you encounter situations where it fits perfectly. See you in the next video.